All right, welcome back to new video. So in today's video, we're going to be making a, another UGC item. Now, my previous video done insanely well. In the last 48 hours, it has 700. So I thought, while this video is doing well, I might as well make another one. And today, we're going to be making a Christmas UGC item, all right? All right, so the first thing you want to do is open up Blender. Now, don't worry about this character. You don't need to have this or anything. I'll just use it as a reference. Anyway, start by doing Control A, then insert a uh, curve, then Bezier, and let's just move this over here. Now go to the Object Data Properties, which is here. Now you want to go to Depth and just scale this up a bit, just like that. And let's change your re resolution to around double, so eight, I would say, so it looks a lot more smooth. Or well, not too much. Let's say, let's say six, like that. Now click this word C in edit mode, so go to tab for edit mode, then do alt and S to scale this up. Now let's go in the Z viewport and then just click this word C, scale it that way, drag it over here, then maybe scale it down a bit, move it back here, just move it around until you get something you like. I'll take keep it there for now. Just drag it over here, and make sure it lines up with our character nicely. Okay, so I'm gonna do S and X, S and Z to scale it this way. Like that. And I'll bring it drag that over there a bit more. Oh, I forgot my mic was off, never mind. Anyway, let's do this. Bring this down a bit more. Here. Okay, that looks awesome. And uh, let's go up here to the stats. And how many vertices is this? 480 vertices. Edges, 944, faces, 464, triangles, 928. Okay, that's fine. We're gonna add a decimate modifier anyway to try to get rid of some. Not too many though. Yeah, just that. So don't remove too much detail. Then we're gonna rotate this a bit around there. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do Control A then mesh and then let's do UV sphere and let's make this around 20 make this around 12 maybe like that now let's shade smooth this and just select some random faces to bring out then I'm gonna add a subdivision apply that then add a decimate modifier around that okay awesome now let's scale this down a bit let's bring that up here bring it to like the edge where the hat ends around there and this is looking awesome so far there we go nice so now we basically have the actual hat what we're gonna do is texture this okay now I'm gonna leave a texture in the description for you um, 
and you can you can use it in case you don't have photoshop or something okay so for this hat uh, it doesn't need a lot of detail all we really need is a red there we go and white so that, that will be awesome now go into material new base color image texture open then open the texture Boom. Now go to UV editing up here. Now let's zoom in a bit. Then go to material mode, just like that. Awesome. Now go here, then A to select all. Scale this down and probably move it. Should we make this bit red? No, no, no. Let's make this bit white. So move that over there. Select these faces, just like that. A select all. Then move it to. Hmm. This bit should also be white to be fair. Now just select the rest. Now let's try selecting all of the all of these vertices, just not the ones for the other bits. Just like this. There we go. Now let's just scale these down. Then move it to the red. And there we go. That looks absolutely awesome. One thing I just noticed is the hat is the wrong way around. Let's have it this way around. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna scale this a bit more. We'll be driving our state, yeah. Look around for the next crowd, yeah. Going our own way. Yeah, that looks awesome. I'm happy with this. Now this is our actual UGC item. So now what we can do is we can go to file, export, wavefront.obj. Make sure you have selected only on the next one. Okay, now open up Roblox Studio, go to Workspace, and insert, insert mesh part. Now go to Mesh ID, Document Center Hat. There we go. Center Hat.obj, open, just click no. Then boom, there you go. This looks absolutely awesome. Now make sure not to rotate it or anything. Now go to plugins, build a rig, block rig. Is it the correct size? I think it is. Yeah, awesome. Now let's just do a few things in the properties. Car shadow off, material, just do anything. I'm gonna do smooth plastic. Oh no, that gives it a shiny effect. Ew. Ew, what is that? Ew, no. Okay, let's keep it like that. Keep it faster. Now just insert a part. Uh, part shadows, sweet plastic. And collide off. Then let's just make the size one by one. 0 0.2, 0 0.2, 0 0.2, like that. Transparency is a one. Let's drag this in the middle of a hat. Around there. Get awesome. Now we can name this handle. Okay, I think we finally got it working. Yeah, awesome. Let's just click play. Or let's script something so when we join it will give us the hat. Then put our hat inside the script. Just like that. There we go, awesome. Nice, now let's just delete our, our other hats. Delete them, and boom, there we go. There is our Santa hat, which looks really nice to be fair. And that will wrap up this video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.